Cool. So um, my name is Johnny Benjamin and I'm a mental health campaigner, um, a writer and a filmmaker. And tell us about your exciting new venture. So uh, yeah, new venture is uh, it's called Beyond Shame, Beyond Stigma, uh, and it's a grant giving, yep. uh, grant giving mental health organisation. Um, so essentially, you know, we know all about lack of funding and, and lack of access to services, and so at the moment we're fundraising and we're going to start giving grants hopefully the end of uh, this year um, to you know the different uh, organizations um, charities basically people working with with young people um, that don't have enough funding there's so many you know great examples of, of, of amazing work that's going on uh, like we went for as an example we went to um, a, a local farm that was um, bringing young people in that have mental health issues um, and doing a program with them that helps them to sort of yeah build up their confidence, build up their self-esteem with the animals on the farm. So they lost all their funding, and so they can't work anymore with these these young people, and it's it's just such a shame. So we want to put grants into projects like that, you know, that are, are, are helping young people, but also you know we want to look at some more support for teachers, more support for families as well, um, and we want to look at support uh, nationwide and also. Um, Schools, colleges, universities, but also those who um, may have dropped out of school, that you know, uh, kind of lost in the system. Um, but yeah, it's a very early days. Of, so, of how, charity. what kind of size of grants do you reckon you're giving out? Well, this is it depends how much we fundraise. Uh, <laughs> Luck to potential, uh, could you put that? Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. It depends how much we fundraise. I mean, to be honest, um, looking at five k, ten k, fifteen k, twenty k, not like huge, huge, huge to start with. But um, yeah, kind of um, smaller grants at first, but then hopefully yeah. we'll get hopefully we'll get bigger and bigger and bigger. Hopefully. Um, and who would you like to kind of like? Can people get in touch with you? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Like, more, like absolutely, yeah, no, no, no. So, so the charity website Beyond Shame Beyond Stigma .uk, um, and then um, so the grant application process will start hopefully maybe September October time. Okay. We're officially kind of launching the charity. Um, yeah, September October time. So then the grant application process will hopefully start then. Um, and then hopefully we can start giving out grants at yeah, the end of the year. But yeah, we're looking for, for kind of um, anything and everything. I'm really particularly interested in sort of creative creative stuff that's happening. So could people um, get in touch with you in the meantime if yeah, they yeah. might have a project that might be interested? Oh gosh, yeah, absolutely. And what about absolutely. if anyone's like passionate about the kind of beyond shame, beyond stigma type thing and they might want to help you in other yeah, ways? So they no, might absolutely. not want a grant, but they want to get involved. Like, yeah. Can they come yeah, sure, no, no, any uh, volunteers and, and fundraisers. Um, yeah, ambassadors as well. Um, so I'm, I'm looking to create actually a, a youth board um, okay. who decides where the grants go. Uh, because yeah, it's important that you know, if it, particularly if it's for young people, then the young people themselves should decide where the grants are going. Um, so yeah, looking for youth ambassadors. Actually. So who would the youth ambassadors be? Is there an age or any other stipulation? Well. Um, to be honest, uh, for me, well, uh, I, was you to speak in your I know, I know, but for me, for me, <laughs> I, I make something up, Johnny. No, <laughs> I, I don't want there to be an age, personally, an age sort of um, restriction. Obviously, I mean, maybe uh, late twenties, early thirties, maybe high bracket, but you know, I'm happy to go sort of as young as possible. He's basically saying I'm too old. No, oh no, no, I don't say that. No, you're not. Um, but no, essentially, um, but I, I'd like to um, have young people with lived experience, but. Lived experience themselves, but also um, maybe family members, yeah. friends that have lived experience as well. You know, anyone with lived experience uh, or, or passion for, for mental health, really. Um, and they can what, email you. Or yeah, yeah, drop us a line. Okay. Sure, drop us a line. And um, yeah, like I said, we're, we're, hopefully we'll set up the youth boards uh, around the same time as kind of you know September, October, when we start to look at the uh, grant giving process. Um, awesome. Cool. Well, so, thank you so much. No, thank you. Thank and, uh, you. Yeah, you too. Thank you.